Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 7th of October 1949, the German Democratic Republic, otherwise known as East Germany, was founded in the Soviet occupied zone of Germany. The constitution that was adopted bore striking similarities to the Weimar Constitution of 1919 and was based largely on a draft written in 1946 that was intended for a united Germany. Consequently, a new constitution was adopted later, in 1968, that more accurately reflected the socialist government of the GDR. The establishment of the German Democratic Republic made permanent the division of Germany that had been implemented in 1945. West Germany had already gained independence from the occupying powers earlier in 1949, and the creation of East Germany meant the same for the formerly Soviet zone, although the ruling Socialist Unity Party of Germany maintained incredibly close ties with the USSR and was therefore seen as a satellite state. The position of head of state was originally taken by Wilhelm Pieck, who was president until his death in 1960. However, in reality, authority lay with the general secretary of the Socialist Unity Party, who, in 1950, was Walter Ulbricht. On the president's death, his position was dissolved and the office of president was replaced by the state council. As the chairman position was commonly held by the party's general secretary, this gave Ulbricht and his successors ultimate power in the GDR. Following the peaceful revolution in 1989, and the fall of the Berlin Wall, East Germany experienced the first truly democratic elections that dramatically reduced the power of the Socialist Unity Party and, later, led to the reunification of Germany that took place on the 3rd of October 1990.